Welcome to my house. I am Frumpy Buckle, and you guys are fisking with Uncle Buck today. And today we're still down in Brazil. We're on the Amazon maze, level 68 waterway. We just completed uh, mission one down there, and we're getting ready to tackle mission two. <clears throat> but before we get started over there, what I wanted to what I wanted to talk to you, what I remind you guys about was, um, don't forget about on Sunday nights we do the bait shop at 7 p.m. So we do the bait shop from 7 to 7:30. And that's usually, I'm on a waterway for that week. I'm working on missions or what have you. And we're talking about the baits that are working for me at that point during the week um, that we fished and how things are going. So what we're going to do, I started last week. We're going to do it again. We're going to continue to do this it's at eight o'clock. I got, the, I got a, uh, if you're a Discord server member, you can get on the, the Fishing Planet Discord server. And I have a voice channel open. I got five voice channels open there. And then we got the live stream. So we've got the chat that we can do. And it's it's been, we had five guys there the last last Sunday. So it's uh, it's kind of fun. It's a chance for you younger guys that are just getting started to hang out with me, Bob. And we talk and we talk about the weapons and get you set up. And <clears throat> what's nice is you can watch how I work a lure. And, and I, it's it's nice that way. And I've been getting a lot of feedback from some of the guys that participate. Now, Wheezy Mouse is usually in the, in on the deal there. And my buddy Micah joins us every once in a while. So we always enjoy his company. All right, guys. So don't forget about that. 8 o'clock um, Eastern Standard Time. Let's talk about the fish that we're going after in this mission. We're going to go after the Bayara, the Jacunda, the Red Eye Piranha, the Silver Croaker out of the drum family there, and the Bicuda. Now, we got one, two, three, four, five fish. We're going to nail them down. <clears throat> and again, the baits. The baits that are in the preferred the, the preferred bait list in, in, inside of Fishing Planter, they're talking about the um, Acura Minnow, the Small Minnow, Shiners, um, Meat Chunks. Kamu Kamu fruit, uh, chicken livers, freshwater prawns, uh, muscle meat is part of this one, clam meat. Now the muscle meat and clam meat, they, they list that up for the croaker. The croaker, he's he, he's like a carp or a catfish. They, they eat a lot of garbage, a lot of junk. And we're going after, oh no, that's the wrong one. I was gonna say, wait a minute, there's no silver arrow one in there. Um, Dobson fly, and dragonflies now i don't really have a preferred bait for this mission like the crickets and the dobson fly larvae were for exploration one um we're going to play it by ear the biara hits on a lot of things the acro minnow mm, the small minnows are good there the red eye piranha hits on the meat chunks the silver croaker will hit on just about anything and the bicuda that's your dragonflies and, and dragon um and dobson fly so and I wanted to show you guys in the last mission, um, the abandoned temple, because that's a nice little spot to fish and I never made it over there. So one of the fish where, where I like to catch these red-eye piranha is actually right there. So we're gonna start, let's get over there. <clears throat> Uh-oh, I don't think I have the game up. Buck, do you? No, now everybody has to wait till you get the game up. <laughs> ah, it's been one of those days, guys. What are you gonna do? Can't start the whole thing all over. It'll only take a second. There we go. All right. All right, let's get over there now. We're on our way up. Okay. Come on. Don't decide to crash on me right now. All right, let's pause this so it gets up. And we are online, finally. All right, guys. Holes, weapons we're taking here. Same, same as I, I didn't go home, so we got the same same weapons as in um, Exploration One. We got the, the Omni Float there. We're taking the Caesar 16.4, uh, the Value Spin with a Crucian 3500 on there. We got uh, the Beastmaster, the Superior 5000. This is from the World Kayak Tour there. Um, <clears throat> my Aguero, Aguero. 610 this is my killer heavy spinning rod 
And of course, a couple of bottom rods here. We got the Mukanzi and a humorous. And that's what we're taking. You know, we got our baits. We went over them. So with that being said here, Matt, we're going to start off over here at the abandoned temple. So we'll jump down there. Get started. Here. I'll see you over there. Okay, guys, we're <clears throat> spawned in here at the abandoned temple. This is what we're looking at here. This little cove right out here. That straight out there is going to be our red eye piranha mark. Um, I don't normally, when I'm doing these videos, I don't normally use a rod stand, but. Alright, next level. Alright, let's, um. <clears throat> Right on here. A little chicken liver and a seven on. We'll throw him out there. You're in the bushes. You're in the weeds this time. What are you doing? All right. <clears throat> I decided we got a little meat chunk on, on this one. We'll throw him out there. Get him in spot two. Alright, now we need to get the Omni float out and see if we can grab that Jacunda over there. Be right back. Okay guys, finally! It took a long time. This guy beside me, I watched him yank up two of them. Alright, the Red Eye Piranha. We can mark him off the list. That's the first one off the list. Oh guys, I tell you, I have been uh, yanking the fish in here. We'll keep him. Take a look here real quick. I want to let you guys know just how this whole produces up back here. Um, just the banded Raccoons. Now that Jacunda is from earlier because that's what we're hunting right now. <laughs> that was from the first mission. Okay. But um, here's the throat. All these All these trophy right here midday 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 these are all caught right now the trophy banded trophy banded trophy banded trophy uh midday trophy spotted all in this dobson fly larva i've been throwing in this hole right now i mean it's just been hammered oscars i just nabbed i just nailed another unique oscar and uh this one right here just nailed him midday right here so <clears throat> This is a this this is a good this is a good hole right here. Now I haven't pulled up the Jacunda yet though. So what we're gonna do, um, I'm probably gonna just toss just a couple of more times in here. If I don't grab him, we're gonna go ahead to where I know the Jacunda are, and we'll, we'll get him marked off the list. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I know a trophy Jacunda spot right over here at the Stone Flower. So we're gonna come over there right now. Spawns in right here. We just walk down here to the end. This ought to be fun on this rod if I can even get over there. I hope I can. All right, bump my hook size up to a two lot with shiners on it. Um, let's just run this down to about 31 inches. I'm gonna go right back in there. Way. One inches is hitting the bottom there. It's got to be marked wrong. Mark that wrong buck. Now we got a bottom rod here. Hmm. Well, I'm going to have to fix that. Be back. Well, we got something <clears throat> hooked up here, fellas. I kind of figured we were going to run into this with this stick, but we'll get them in here. This is a fun stick to have with you. It's not good for making video. <laughs> it takes a while to get these fish in. No.
Oh boy. All right, guys, I'll be back in a while once I get him here in front of us. Oh, that for a red belly. All right. We'll keep him. He's money. We'll be back. I'm hooked up again. That last one was a uni red belly piranha. I don't know what I got this time. But everything that's coming out of that hole is a little big for this pole. But I'm having a lot of fun. <laughs> uh oh. Another big one. Oh well. Oh, big for this pole. They're not big fish. But. They're fun to play. There you come. Oh, he wants to run. Probably another damn piranha. Alrighty, guys. I'll be back when I get this guy in. He gives me... Might be. Nope. Butterfly peacock bass. Not what we want. <clears throat> Four pounder. That's a nice fight. All right, we'll be back. Well, we're on again. See what else we pull out of this hole. <laughs> this has actually been a pretty decent day for me. I know I'm not doing well as far as the mission goes, but I'm catching some nice fish on this pole. It's fun. All right, guys, I'll be back. Well, fellas, <clears throat> if you're going to do it, that's the way to do it. There's our Jacunda. We can mark him off the list. A uni no left. That was a nice fight. That, I enjoyed every bit of that one. Alrighty, we'll keep him. Okay, what's next on our list here? Biara. Uh, I ain't got any Biara over here. Alright, let me... I'll be right back. Let me get my map out here, fellas, and decide where it's which way we're heading. All right. See you in a bit. All right, guys, I'm back. Oh. All right. Let's see what's going on here. I got two bottom rods down out there, and they got they got croaker meat on them. One's got muscle. One's got freshwater prawns. I got shiners here. I was throwing right in the middle. I'm trying to grab a Biara out of the middle there. There's that marker out there for Biara. Come on, good guy. Come on. I got one hammering. Is this my Biara? No, another one flat went through catfish. That's not what I wanted. Well, maybe a croaker here? Let's hope so. I think so. There he is. Alright, there's our silver croaker. We can mark him off the list. So we've got the Biara and the Bicuda. They're the only two left. Alright, we'll keep him. Put that one away. Looks like we got one ready to scream here. So let's get this out in there first before he starts screaming. And get him down. All right, we're coming to get you. I'm coming to get you. Crying like a baby. Oh. There's two croakers on both muscle meat and freshwater prawns. Nice trophy one there. We'll keep them. All right, guys. Be right back. Oh, well, guys, I think. <clears throat> there he is. <laughs> what a better way to pull up a barrar. It's a uni. All right, we can mark him off the list. What do we got left? Just the bike. Buddha. That's it. We'll keep him. And uh, let me decide where we're going to go. I'll pull out my, my notes here. 
Welcome to my house, guys. And the disaster it is, as always. Well, I'm in the middle of exploration number two. Had everything done. All I had was one last fish, the Bicuda. And, um, Weezy Mouse wanted to go out for some burritos and refried beans and rice. So, well, I'm up for that. So we did it. Left everything on pause. Came back. Had a beautiful last session for the last fish. Everything couldn't have gone more to plan. And no friggin' audio. I don't know what happened to my mic. Somehow my system defaulted over to my internal mics and my cameras. Bad news. So, I'm not going to have any music for the last part of this. Um... I don't want to. I don't want to dub over it because there there is audio. If you turn your volume up all the way, yeah, you got a little bit of loud sounds um, <laughs> with the environment sounds. However, you can hear me and you can hear what I'm saying and, and you can see what's going on. So I know. Hey, I never claimed to be a videographer or whatever the hell that word is. I'm just a fisherman and I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying to do a good job for you guys, and I didn't do such a great job. And I should be way better at the technology, but this one wasn't my fault. I'm telling you, I don't know what the hell's the matter. How the hell can your microphone just go away? And when you go to Hardware and Sounds, look, I'm a computer engineer. I went to Hardware and Sounds. The mic was gone. Absolutely gone. From Control Panel, from my configuration. Had to do a cold boot, shut her down, boot her back up to find it. All right. Anyway, with that being said, this video is not that long. It was fun doing this because I had little poles. I was stuck with level 6 and level 10 poles on a level 68 lake. I had a lot of fun. I really did. I might try this again. Anyway, let's get back to the video. Again, I'm not going to put any music in this because if I add anything, you won't be able to hear shit. So just... From this point on, for the rest, it's only a couple of minutes, and because I catch I catch what we need right away. So anyway, crank your volume up, take a listen. And thanks for watching. We'll see you later. Ah, uh, what's the next one? The trial. All right, we'll be out with the trial. We're going bass fishing. Uh, Buck loves to bass fish. All right, we'll see you. actually put you in on the other side, okay, um, what I did basically was walk around, walk around the totem pole to where you spawn in over there, come over here to this side right here, okay, this is where we're at right here, let me pull the map out for you so you can see, spawn in over here, you come up through the totems and you come out to the right here, and you have access to all this out here, so I've got my poles all loaded up, we only go after one fish, so I've got, um, we're going after the Bicuda. <clears throat> what I've got on here, I don't think we have, a, do we have my, I wonder if I have my lake tied up. Nope. No lake tied up, huh? Nope. All right, I'll have to read it from over here. Then. <laughs> so, we got Araku minnows, small minnows, shiners, Dobson fly, and dragonfly. Those are our, those are our live baits. And for lures, for this guy, it's poppers and walkers and soft baits. So, let's start pulling. I got everything loaded up already. So, right now, we got a four-rod hook. We got small minnows on this guy. That's my Bicuda spot over there. Let me throw this guy out there first. Right, put him down in four. Now, six I have loaded up with the Iraqi minnow. We'll throw him over there too in that area. Put him down in three. Alright, let's get one up here. Now this is Shiners. We'll throw that out there too. The hell. I'm going for broke. I don't normally do this, but it's the last fish and we're cutting her close to our 20 minute time frame. 
this too. We got a dragonfly on here. Now this pole won't get out there very far. But we'll throw him out there, clear out here. That's as far as he goes. <laughs> I got my Lone Star level 10 poles with me, and I'm on a level 68 lake. You gotta love that. But Buck's doing it. You know, I never give up the fight. If there's a will, there is a way. All right. So now I got some spinning rods here, ready to go. Um, let's see here. This guy's got a popper on. We're gonna work this popper for a while. Let's see if we can. We've got enough out here. That fish is in there. He's gonna hit on something. All right, guys. I'm gonna start working this. And, well, I guess I'm not. Uh, let's go down and see what we got here already. Uh oh. figure out what's on this one here. This is going to be a good fight. <laughs> now, this is the first one that hit. We got the first one in, huh? All right, guys. I'm sure all that's all screwed up. Oh, no. Not too bad, actually. Yeah. Well, that completes Exploration 2 for the Amazon Maze. The Bayara, the Daikundu, the Red Eye Piranha, the Silver Croaker, and the Bicuda. And we got him in line pretty much down the line. So I think we started off with the red eye for all. So. But I hope that helps out here, guys, a little bit. And, you know, there's, there's so many places to find these fish. And I'm sure you'll find your own spots for them, you know. Uh, when you get here, you don't have to. Uh, if you get in the bind, you can always pull out my stuff. But, you know, when you tackle these waterways, find a new spot. Oh, who wants to catch fish where everybody says you know there that the fish lives there? The whole point of fishing is catching fish where nobody else can catch them. That's the deal. <laughs> All right, fellas. Well, that'll end it pretty much close it up for this one. Let me mark that. Expiration 2 off the list. All right, what do we got next? The trial mission. Oh, we're going after the bass. The bass and the eel. Oh, we could be in real trouble with these sticks I got. We'll see how it goes. Alrighty, guys. Remember, hit that like button. Hit subscribe. Check out the bell. Follow me on Facebook. And above everything else, never ever 
give up the fight. See you later. Listen to the crickets sing. Rattle up and don't change. Listen to the southbound breeze just creeping through the trees. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> <laughs>